Though they hid in tunnels, under hospitals and schools, terrorism is defeated at last. Let's hear about it. Good afternoon, welcome back ladies, gents and Pikachus. At last, some good news, some real good news. And that is that Israel have completely flattened Hamas. They've pretty much 99.9% .9 won this war. And what that means for us in the West is we're going to have one last noisy few days or maybe a week of uh, pro-terrorism supporters as they bang their clubs against the wall and they make the last bit of noise they're going to make. And then after that, silence and peace at last. What we've all been waiting for. So, I wonder after that when the inquest will begin into the propagandists such as The Telegraph, The Independent and The BBC, my personal favourite. When will the inquest begin into how it was they got away with inciting so much violence in the minds of regular, normal British people? Because it will not stop here. Oh no. The people in control of the BBC, they're not going to stop just because the war is over, just because they have been defeated. They're not going to give up. These are not moral, honest people. These people are here as an incitement to violence. That's the only reason they're in this country and the only reason they're interested at all in meddling with the ins and outs of our news broadcasts and therefore our thoughts. So I just wanted to make a quick broadcast to say don't fear these people and don't listen to these people. They are the ones that fear us because we have the truth. We have justice in our hearts. We know what's good and we're not going to be defeated by a bunch of cowardly little shadow rats which is what these people are and their little cohorts you know they can stir up minorities with promises of whatever they promised god knows what it was that they said they were going to give to these people obviously they're not going to get it um so that's the end of this video and the end of this broadcast which i hope you enjoy and i hope it warms your heart to know that even after all is said and done the good people of this country will prevail and they have done not only here but in every country in the world. Across the world we have seen a complete changing of the guard, a complete change of people's minds as they realise they have been lied to. So there will be a new wave of anger, not against anyone outside the country, the anger will be inward. It will be towards the government and the media and those who thought they could pull the wool over our eyes and trick us into working for the enemy who wishes to destroy us. No, we will not be beaten, we will not be destroyed. We shall prevail. And that's the end of this video. So I hope you enjoyed that and I'll see you in the next one. Bye now. Oh, I'm absolutely loving this. We're literally within three days of the official announcement of this victory. And the people who have to announce it are the leftist terrorist supporters. Come on guys, do what you have to do, do your jobs. <laughs> see you soon. Bye now.